in the name of almighty allah in this video you will learn how we can find anti derivative of under radical x minus 1 whole square so first of all we know very well that a plus b whole square equal to a square minus 2 ab plus b square similarly you can fa use formula here so that's why you can see that under radical x whole square similarly minus 2 ab so that's why minus 2 under radical x into 1 plus b square means 1 square okay so now we have to simplify so you can see here under radical x square so we know very well that under radical and square uh, both are anti of each other so that's why here x only and minus 2 under radical x into 1 equal to minus 2 under radical x plus 1 square equal to 1 okay so now you can see here under radical uh, x change into x power 1 over 2 because both are similar but it's easy for us if we write it in this way we can then we can easily find anti derivative so now finding anti derivative you can see here the anti derivative of x equal to x power n equal to x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus c similarly you can find anti derivative of x similarly you can find anti derivative of x power 1 over 2 and anti derivative of 1 okay so now finding anti derivative you can see here the anti derivative of x equal to x power 1 plus 1 divided by 1 plus 1 similarly as anti derivative of x power n equal to x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus c similarly minus 2 same and the anti derivative of x power 1 over 2 equal to x power 1 over 2 plus 1 divided by 1 over 2 plus 1 and anti derivative of 1 equal to we can see that x only plus c sam so now again we have to simplify so you can see that x power 1 plus 1 equal to x power 2 and divided by 1 plus 1 equal to okay so minus 2 sam and x power 1 over 2 plus 1 equal to 3 over 2 similarly here 1 over 2 plus 1 equal to 3 over 2 plus x sam plus c okay so now again we have to simplify so you can see that x power uh, 2 divided by 2 minus 2 sam and if we write uh, here so it will change into 2 over 3 3 over 2 change into 2 over 3 so x power 3 over 2 sam plus x plus c now again we have to simplify so you can see that x square divided by 2 minus 2 into 2 equal to 4 divided by 3 sam and x power 3 over 2 plus x plus c so that's a simple answer and if you have any confusion any query any question you can ask in comment section thank you